Hello all, I'm Hong Jun, a PhD student in the Geometric Media Lab at Arizona State University. I'm pleased to present my work at WACB. Today, I'll be talking about understanding the role of a mix-up in knowledge distillation. Thanks all of you for coming. Knowledge distillation is one of the promising solutions to make an efficient model. Then the final goal of the knowledge distillation is to train on this student network by using teacher's knowledge, hoping students have incomparable performance to the teacher. This way ensure that we are able to deploy the small network on the edge device. However, there are limitations as follow. Unfortunately, most work do not involve a deep analysis of the relationship between model complexity and the distillation method. Also, it still remains unclear as to which teacher model lead to the best student model. We do not have a quantitative judgment about good knowledge from the perspective of the student network. Therefore, we feel the need for a deep understanding of the inner working of the model when distilling. To understand the inner working of the network, we bring the mix up into the knowledge distillation framework. I found that there is a connecting link between mixup and the distillation. Mixup is a popular data augmentation technique to create a new training data by linearly combining two images and labels. Let me give you the connection between the, these two methods. So intuitively, the student runs from the smooth probability distribution of the teacher, whereas the mixup tries to artificially inject smoothness into the label by mixing two examples and their labels. So on the surface, mixup and the KDs are very different. However, we found that smoothness turns out to be connecting link, which is very important attribute to understanding KDs interplay with mixup. In this study, we inspect the behavior of the network trained with a mixup in the presence of knowledge distillation through extensive analysis, visualization, and comprehensive experiments. Starting from this motivation, we try to make an intriguing observation, and you might want to see them in the main paper. Based on our finding, we suggest the effective learning strategy, partial mixup, which is to generate only a small amount of the mixup pair used in the training. Rescale the logic by using standard deviation as a temperature. Thereby, the temperature is no longer a hyperparameter. Now let's look at the classification results on CIFAR 100 dataset. If you look at the bottom table, generally we can see the proposed method outperform consistently the baseline method. Actually, we have a more extensive research and performance analysis in the main paper, including large scale data sets such as ImagineNet. Please refer to them if you are interested. We also tested the proposed model against the adversary attack. This table shows the top one accuracy on the different perturbation level. For a fair comparison, we apply the mix of augmentation to all methods we explore. Even with only 10% mix of pair used, our methods show impressively resistance to both attack FGSM and IFGSM. Here are key takeaway. In this work, we study the role of the mix up in knowledge distillation by analyzing the inner working of the model. We support our finding through the series of the empirical analysis and large scale experiments. We believe that the finding of this study provide insightful suggestion to researcher and the practitioner uh, that use the those technique. Thank you.